What's up everybody, welcome to the video. Today we are gonna find out the fate of the Furious. The movie starts in a couple hours, but right now we are going to head out to the pre-meet before we go to the movie. We're getting together with a big group of people and we're all gonna go see the movie. I got Megan with me right here. So we just got our pre-tickets and now we're gonna head over to the meet. Just made it out to the meet out here in the BX parking lot on one of the bases here in Japan. Let's take a walk around, I'm gonna do some music and show you guys some of the cars that are out here before it gets too dark. This meet is probably all over the place. I had the GoPro first and then I used the other camera and I'm not sure if I'm gonna mix that footage in or keep it separate, try to do some kind of montage. I'm not really sure what you guys have seen up to this point. A little bit of a hectic video, trying to figure out my night shooting. That's one of the hardest things to do here is get good video at night. I'm gonna have to upgrade the camera possibly. Here in just a moment, we're gonna be heading over to the theater to actually watch the Fast and Furious movie. I don't know how I feel about it. We're gonna see how it turns out, but um, you know how the Fast and Furious have kind of become. They've strayed away from the cars and everything we grew up watching, but it's something I have to watch just because I've been following the series. So we'll see how it goes. I'm not gonna throw any spoilers in here. We are walking over to the movie theater now. See how this goes. Pick you guys up in about two hours. Gotta get refreshments first. Steven. what the Fast and Furious has become. We're back at the house, the movie's over. Everybody pretty much just went home after the movie, it was getting late, it's like midnight right now. And I don't even know if I feel like talking about the movie. Obviously I don't want to give anything away since it's just now coming out, but it's just not what it used to be at all. I was really hoping once I sat down, I was like, I gave it a chance, I was like, you know, maybe they can make something happen, maybe it'll be somewhat like how it used to be. But this one was, 
kind of unbearable for me, actually. The only thing holding it together was some old faces you see in it and some of uh, Roman's typical behavior and how he acts and what he talks about and stuff. That's some of the only stuff that really kind of kept it together for me and kept me sane during the movie because that just... I don't know. I'll let you guys see it and you comment and let me know what you guys think about the movie, but... I didn't think it was very good at all. But, like I said, it is late and Mason is sleeping over at a friend's house tonight and we're gonna go pick him up early in the morning and go do some fun stuff as a family. So I'm gonna get to bed. Uh, I hope this video was enjoyable. I really don't know what it's gonna be like. Obviously, I haven't started editing it. Um, I'm just gonna get home now and throw the stuff at the computer and work on it some tomorrow, but I don't know. Nighttime videoing is not my favorite thing to do. I switch between the GoPro and my other camera. So, like I said, apologize if it was a little bit of an odd video. I just wanted to be able to video some of the meat, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm gonna go get some sleep now. I will see you guys in the next video. As always, thanks for watching. I'm just now getting to editing this video and the end seems pretty depressing. This is not a depressing video. It just wasn't a very good movie in my opinion. Here's some bonus footage.